Maladex is no more. It has been killed and from now on shall be known as Axo. In this video, we're going to talk a little bit about what this change means and what we can expect for the future of Maladex. Damn it, Axo. Welcome to Late Game Crypto. My name is Josh and I'm here helping make smarter investments for late game gains. Remember, anything you see in any of my videos is not to be taken as financial advice. Do your own research and own your own decisions. I will be the first to admit that I have not covered what was formerly known as Maladex as much as they really deserve. But then again, now I don't have a whole library filled with content that is now outdated. And now might be a fantastic time to start populating the YouTube algorithms with AXO content. And do be sure to hit that like button if you agree so that we can help the YouTube algorithm learn the association between Maladex and now AXO. Also, it'll help me to know that you guys want to be seeing more AXO content, which would motivate me more to populate YouTube's content library about the new brand. Now, what is the reason for this rebrand? Well, in the most practical terms, in working with world-class branding experts, they decided that they needed to drop the Dex from the name in order to make it cleaner. Drop the the, just Facebook. It's cleaner. Maladex, or AXO, decided that the term DEX was much too limiting for the scope of the protocol. Because if you know anything about Maladex slash AXO, they're building a whole slew of advanced financial tools that goes way beyond just what a decentralized exchange does. They're creating financial tools around programmability that allow you to automate your asset management with greater functionality and more access to more diverse types of assets than anywhere else in the space. And we're talking synthetic assets and shorts and derivatives and a DCA schedule and a whole slew of things that you would be able to dig up in their 96 page white paper. And you know what, after the whole rebranding thing now actually sounds like a decent time to consider doing that white paper breakdown video series that I was talking about doing like a year ago. I'll tell you what, if this video makes it to 100 likes, I will go ahead and do it. And 100 likes isn't easy by the way, especially in a crypto bear market when so many people have left the market. But then again, neither is a 96 page white paper breakdown series, so be sure to hit that like button and let's make this thing happen. From the perspective of your average investor, it might sound like AXO is just building complex financial tools only for the advanced users, but really AXO is just as committed to education as they are to innovation. Once they have the functional tools that they can roll out to the public, they're going to be just as aggressive on the educational front in onboarding new users to teach them what the heck they're doing in this space. What form that educational content is going to come in, I have no idea, but the core team behind this project is more than qualified to be expert educators in the Cardano space. There is nobody on this core team that has less than 10 years of experience in their specialized role, and actually that's just on the lower end. Most of the people on this core team have closer to like 15 to 20 years of experience. On the financial side of things, they've got loads of experience in asset management and consulting and quantitative analysis and market research and a whole load of other financial stuff that I only pretend to understand. AXO is one of those few projects in the space that I have absolutely nothing bad to say about them. They're built on top of the principles of efficiency and self-sovereignty and democratization and they don't try to do anything flashy just for the sake of marketing. They demonstrate a true, undeniable passion for innovation and individual freedom that is missing from like 99% of the crypto space. I cannot contain my excitement for the launch of this product and I have insane respect for the development team that carefully crafted every little design detail behind this project and I'm excited to help rebuild the content on YouTube following this rebrand. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss any of my Cardano-based content every Tuesday and Thursday. As always, remember never to invest more than what you can afford to lose, learn as much as you can about this space, and play for the late game. Thanks so much for watching.